10 great places in the UK to take your EV this Easter. Easter is the perfect time to put on your flat cap and take a road trip in your EV. The weather is usually lashing it down, I mean um, mild, and there are plenty of beautiful places to visit. Here are 10 places in the UK to take your EV this Easter. The Lake District. The Lake District is one of the most popular tourist destinations in the UK, and for good reason. The sunny scenery, rolling hills and picturesque villages are sure to take your breath away. There's also plenty of activities to keep you busy, such as hiking, biking and boating. I believe they even have Greggs there now. 2. The Scottish Highlands Scottish Highlands are another great place to visit in your electric car. The dramatic scenery, including mountains, lochs and forests, is sure to amaze you. There are also plenty of opportunities to go hiking, fishing and camping. If you want to laugh, you can watch all the ice clunkers struggle up the hills. The Yorkshire Dales The Yorkshire Dales are a beautiful area of limestone dales, moors and forests. There are plenty of villages and towns to explore, as well as opportunities for hiking, biking and horse riding. Of course, with this being in Yorkshire, the best county in the UK, it should have been number one on the list, but I just wanted to be contrary. 4. The Cotswolds Cotswolds are a charming area of rolling hills, pretty villages and historic towns. This is the perfect place to relax and enjoy the English countryside. The breed of sheep that roam the hills is known as the Cotswold Lion. But don't go asking to see the lions, people will think you're bonkers. 5. The Norfolk Broads Norfolk Broads are a network of rivers, lakes and canals, so it's a great place to go boating, fishing and bird watching. Apparently Norfolk has 659 medieval churches, the highest concentration in the world. If only EVs ran on prayer, you'd be sorted. 6. The South Downs South Downs are a range of chalk hills that run along the southeast coast of England. So it's a great place to go hiking, biking and walking. Yes, there are also some amazing sculptures in the chalk hills, but don't be flying your drone and disrupting the peace trying to get an aerial view. The Peak District. Peak District is a national park in north of England. This is a great place to go hiking, biking and rock climbing. You could pack a picnic and watch the tourists wheezing up Mam Tor. Hours of fun. The Brecon Beacons. Brecon Beacons are a national park in South Wales. This is a great place to go hiking, biking and mountain biking. The Brecon Beacons is an international dark sky reserve. So best be careful on the use of those LED headlights or people will think the aliens are coming. 9. Snowdonia Snowdonia is a national park in North Wales. It's a great place to go hiking, biking and climbing. Welsh is spoken by 58% of the park's population, who probably, to quote Edmund Blackadder, need half a pint of phlegm in their throats just to pronounce the place names. The Isle of Wight Isle of Wight is a great place to go for a beach holiday or to explore the island's many historical sites. It's allegedly the most haunted place on earth, proof that whatever they, they get up to over there, they often see things that aren't there. No matter what you're looking for on a road trip, you're sure to find it in the UK. So get in your EV and hit the open road, but don't stray from too far from Yorkshire for too long. Here are some tips for planning your EV road trip. Plan your route. Before you set off, it's important to plan your route. This will help you make sure that you have enough charge to reach your destination. You can use ZapMap or a navigation app to plan your route. Check the weather forecast. It's also important to check the weather forecast before you set off. This will help you dress appropriately and to plan for any potential hazards such as snow or ice. Whatever the forecast says, pack for rain. After all, this is a bank holiday period. You know it'll rain. Charge your car. Make sure your car is fully charged before you set off. It'd be daft not to, especially with the cost of public charges these days. Pack a granny charger. It's a good idea to pack a granny charger, if you have one, with you in case you need to charge your car somewhere remote that's only got a three-pin plug. Plan for brakes. It's important to take brakes when you're driving, especially if you're driving long distances. This will help you stay alert and to avoid getting tired. 
Many modern EVs might have a long range, but the average middle-aged bladder doesn't. Enjoy the journey. Driving an EV is a great way to see the UK. Soak up the scenery and enjoy.